Well, we've had Carl for about two years now. He started off as an itty bitty little algae eater and his friend Leo passed away oh, about two months ago. They were cellmates, oh, not cellmates, aquarium mates with one another. And one day we found Carl kissing Leo, only to figure out that Leo was dead and Carl wasn't kissing Leo. So now has cut, uh, come the time that Carl is going to be released into the big pond to have lots of algae. So here we are with our aquarium. We have the plants on the top, sucking up the nutrients of the ammonia from the uh, water, keeping the water clean. And we had this circulating with pumps. And now Carl needs more algae to eat and more decay. So we're going to take him out to our friend, the trembles and release him in the wild with his friend, the big mouth bass and all sorts of other little fish like perch and, and minnows and such. So we hope that he can clean up the trembles garden in their pond. So here begins our journey for Carl from home desk to the farm. So now we have Carl and all of his pumps and heater is gone. His roof of his beautiful plants are out and Carl is hiding in his favorite cave. I just see one eyeball sticking out. Maybe come on over here. Maybe you can find the little eye and see Carl's eye down in the cave. Can you see him there? Yep. So Carl is going to go for a ride and we're going to put him down here in this big, big tote so that when he sloshes in the car, he'll water will slosh out or if he decides to jump out, He'll just jump and be in our bucket. All right, next journey is to the Escalade. Here comes Carl, past the laundry machine. Last time he came through here was two years ago. He was just a minor little tadpole, but now he's a killer algae eater. And come on, follow me. Now, going for a ride in the old Cadillac, sometimes called Dad's Miracle. 18 years old now, 140,000 miles, going strong. So here we go, in the back for a ride. Hopefully this isn't the green mile and Carl's gonna grow and be bigger and this is not his death sentence. All right, come on, we're gonna shut it and we're going for a ride. Car started, here we go, backing out the driveway. We have Carl in the back Tilly in the back seat too. Mom decides she wants to join us and, and join us and say bon voyage, Carl. Happy algae eating. First off, I want to show you where Carl's new home is. It's over here in this big pond. Much better than his one gallon tank. Look at all that algae he can eat and a lot of new friends he's gonna make. Come on, let's get him out of the car. Well, here we are at the pond. Water level's down a little bit compared to the spring, but it's still up. We've been in a drought. So I put on my waders, headed to the edge of the pond. Carl's still hanging out in his castle. So it's Carl's castle. So mom wants us to leave the castle. So he has a place to hide here amongst his new friends. So let's go down to the shore and see if we can't release him. Be careful, careful as we step, it's a little spongy, though Tilly the dog has already been in, went for a swim full of mud. Oh, she's black now, there she goes. Hi Tilly, you enjoying the release of Carl? So here we go. Hey Boomer, there's frogs, all sorts of little guys. So here I go. So we need to, Pull out Carl's nice little plants. There it is. Stayed green, never turned brown. We're gonna get our moss ball. Look at that, moss ball. We're gonna put it right there. It's gonna grow. Now, let's see. Right in the muck and the mire. Get a little pond water in. 
see if we can get a little pond water in to acclimate him to the temperature and the new water. Here we go. Carl's still hanging in his castle. Oh, I'm stuck in the muck. Are you just pushing him out? Yep, Carl. Come over here. Let's see Carl. Okay. He went to the muddy depths of the Trimble Pond to eat and eat. Hopefully not to be eaten. All right. So here comes Carl from PetSmart to Pet Paradise. All right. Ta-ta.